When we connect a 68 ohm carbon film low wattage resistor to a 220 volt power supply, around 3.24 amps of current flows through it, causing a power dissipation of approximately 714 watts. This intense heat buildup eventually causes the resistor to overheat and burn out. During the burning process, the outer protective coating is the first to burn, revealing the internal structure of the carbon film resistor. Something that often sparks curiosity. A carbon film resistor is constructed from a ceramic rod coated with a thin layer of carbon film that provides resistance while conducting electricity. A helical groove is carefully cut through the carbon film, forming a long, narrow corkscrew-like path from one end of the rod to the other. Metal caps are crimped onto both ends of the rod, with wire leads attached to allow connectivity. The entire assembly is then dipped in a protective coating and painted with color-coded stripes to indicate its resistance value. Once the protective coating is burned or removed, the spiral groove becomes clearly visible. Cutting the resistor vertically reveals its internal structure, a ceramic core surrounded by a thin, tightly wound carbon film. This layered construction explains how the resistor achieves its precise resistance value.